This is Borzu Deragahi uh, of The Independent. I'm in uh, Tiraspol. It is the capital of Transnistria. Uh, this is a region of um, the country of Moldova that is uh, under the control of Russia. Um, and it's uh, uh, you know, very much contested by the Moldovans. Um, uh, it's, it's a sort of version of Ukraine where you have a, um, a kind of Russian controlled space like uh, this one here in the same way that Russia controlled Crimea. Uh, and, and so there's a lot of fear that, you know, if Russia is seeking to consolidate its hold on its former empire, this area could be next. Are people here scared, Victoria? Are people in Moldova and Transnistria scared of what's happening in Ukraine coming yes, here? Yes, we do. Oh, yes, we do. Yes. We really worry about this. Yes, we do. And we we are worried and we would like to have a peace in Ukraine. This is our neighbors, they are our relatives. It's a close country to us. We call relatives kind of people. Yes, yeah. because a lot of people, they have really have a relatives over there. But a lot of the people here say they, they like Russia and they consider Russia a friend. And uh, here you have some of the, the, the kind of the, the monuments. Uh, that behind me, for example, there's a statue of Lenin. Um, this area, because of the war in Ukraine, it's also on the border of Ukraine. This area is very tense right now. And as a matter of fact, we just came across a, um, a bridge where there was Russian soldiers uh, uh, kind of gripping their weapons. There was a, a pro-Ukrainian protests here. There have been pro-Russian protests here uh, in recent days. Uh, people are telling me, um, and, and there's a lot of fear.